I'm Dr. Edwards from City Schools of Decatur. So glad to be here. Thankful for GSBA for all their leadership. I have with me Dr. Van Zulen, who's the Associate Superintendent. And as you can see, he's already prepared. He's our, <laughs> our technology guru, but um, he's really leading us in, in the charge for many of our initiatives. And I also have our board member, Bernadette Seals. I can tell you about Bernadette. Bernadette is wonderful on the board. She does her homework, just like you do. Um, a lot of times, Bernadette won't say anything, but when she says something, boy, it goes right to the point. So I'm very appreciative. I, too, have a phenomenal board. I see Valerie Wilson as our board chair. You see Valerie in the back. You saw ba Valerie uh, took the lead in the visioning project, which we are very proud that she did, and we want to connect that. So we see this as a way um, to really get in and learn more about eBoard and how we can use it to connect the visioning project that Valerie has been part of and so many of the other folks that you saw, as well as what we're doing right now with our strategic plan. That was high mind priority for us. We are a small city school system, uh, less than 3,000 children. We um, have a good reputation. We've been in existence for a long time. Um, in eight years for a superintendent, that's me right now, so I feel like I've, I've met the national average and I'm very proud of that. I think you're um, beyond the national <laughs> average. I probably <laughs> doubled it. <laughs> but we have a very active community, as probably many of you do. Um, they want to know what we're doing, what we're planning, what our decisions are, and they want to know it almost before it comes you know, out of our brain and into our mouth. Um, you probably have dealt with that, some of that too. So part of why we find this such a great project for us and a, a, just a fantastic way to reach our community is because they're able to access what we're talking about before we start talking about it. When we put our agendas together, they're able to go on and access eBoard and see the different things that we're working on. We're also one of the first charter systems. Uh, we were one of the ones that decided to walk through the portal and we didn't know what we were walking through. But I think it was a good thing for us to become a charter system. And when you're a charter system, that means that you have a different, different governance structure. And I'm sure that when you get into your questions, we'll talk more about this. But using eBoard um, for our school leadership teams was another way that we could reach out even further to the community. So again, thank you, Mark, for your leadership. Thank you.